Hello everybody, my name is Wendy Argenbright. I am with Westmore's EdTech team and I just wanted to go over real quickly with you an easy way to submit an assignment for your student, whether they are in class or at home. So here is a standard Canvas course and when your student logs in, you're going to come over here to their to-do list. This is the easiest way to find their assignments. Come down here, we're going to pick this assignment called Worksheet Camera. We're actually going to show you how to use a camera either on a laptop or a mobile device to submit an assignment for a student. So when we open up this assignment, the teacher has created it so that there is a PDF that they have uploaded into the assignment. Now this would be the same worksheet that they might hand the student in class. So for instance, if your student was in the classroom, the teacher would make a photocopy of the assignment. The student would fill the assignment out. Normally, they would just hand this paper back into the teacher. Okay. If your student was at home on option two, then your student would be able to see the PDF. You can see we have a little preview here. It doesn't require any software. You don't have to download the file. You can simply view it on a computer, a tablet, or a mobile device. Then the student can take a standard sheet of notebook paper and write the responses down in the notebook paper. We are not requiring any of the students to have the ability to print at home. So standard notebook paper is absolutely acceptable for these types of assignments. Now, a student in class, if the teacher requests, they can go ahead and submit this assignment electronically, even though they have the paper copy of the assignment. So to do that, they're going to use their mobile device and they're either going to use uh, the camera on their laptop or they can use the camera on their phone. So the easiest way that I have found to do this is to use an app called the <laughs> OneDrive app. So you can see right here, this is the OneDrive app. It is free. You can download that from uh, the Amazon store, Google Play store, or the um, iTunes. And the one nice thing about this is you can have the student link this app to their more schools or their more students.com account. So anything that they uh, record using this app is automatically saved to their more students.com OneDrive account. So you can see that it has access to all of these files. So at the bottom of the app is a little camera icon. So your student is going to click on that icon and they're going to simply take a picture of that document. Now that document can be on any surface and what it's going to do is it's going to identify just the document portion of that photo, hit confirm, and it's going to clear up all of the background noise. Now you can go in here and edit this and we can rotate it around so that it's actually straight up and down by using these edit buttons here at the bottom. And once we're done with that, we're going to go ahead and submit that to our OneDrive. And I've already done that for this specific account. The exact same method is used if your student is at home and they have a paper worksheet. So they are going to take the same OneDrive app on any device. They're going to go to the camera feature. So they're going to go right back to that camera option and they're going to take a picture of their notebook paper. And again, works the exact same way. It's going to clear out everything that is outside of that photo. And it's going to leave you with just a nice clean document. So again, we're going to hit the more button. We're going to rotate that document until it looks the way we want it to look. And that is what we're going to be submitting to the students teachers. So this is a nice, easy way for the students to submit documents back to their teacher when they're at home. So now let me show you on the computer what that's going to look like. So this next step is the same regardless of whether they're at home or in the classroom. They're going to click on the green Submit Assignment button. And there's going to be a couple of different options here. They can do a file upload. So if the file is somewhere on their actual computer, they can click Choose File and search through the File Explorer on their computer. However, because we've used the OneDrive device, this file has uploaded directly to your student's Office 365 file. So we're going to go down here and we're going to find, here's the two scans. They are 
uh, file name saved by the date of the image. So you can see here, this is a scan from October 7th at 4.24 p.m. So we're going to go ahead and we are going to click on this first scan. My image is in the way here. Sorry. There we go. And we're going to simply attach that file. We're going to submit the assignment. And your student, when they submit it successfully, is going to say resubmit assignment instead of submit. And the submission details are going to be right here. So the time that your student submitted the file is recorded. The date is recorded. The actual copy is right here, so your student is able to click on this and see exactly what got submitted. Okay, so I hope this helps. Um, and if you have any questions about submitting assignments, feel free to contact your teacher. Um, you can also contact uh, MPS EdTech at moreschools.com, and we can walk you through any of these assignment types. Thank you very much. Have a nice day.